what most people don't realize is that mobile phone towers. That entire area is affected by the directional transmitter that's actually communicating with that tower. And put a shielding paint on the wall. You don't want to use a phone roll. Matter of fact, 95% of those circuit cutter switches installed without consultation are installed incorrectly and there's no benefit. Okay, we are here in Parap, a suburb of Darwin in Northern Australia. Now, nearby we've got a airport, uh, civil and military as well. Now, of course, the airport is fitted with a uh, radar. And as you may have seen in some of our other videos, we did a little special about airport radars. Now, here we've got our instrument to measure high frequency radiation, and so I can measure my body. But as we can already start hearing, there's a little chirp that you hear every now and then. Every, it comes at regular intervals. Well, that's exactly the same sound that we could hear when we were doing that video on the radars. So, um, here we are about... There that is again, Chip. Uh, here we are about four kilometers, about, um, what's that, about two and a half, um, uh, two and a half miles or so away from the airport. You have here standing on somebody's balcony. And we have the same thing in the bedrooms as well, um, where we've got a constant exposure of that, uh, of that airport radar. So I'll put a little bit closer just so you can hear the sound a bit better. So here we are, closer to the navigation aid, with the eastern runway of the uh, Darwin International Airport. And uh, in the distance we can see the control tower, and also uh, the other end, the radar. So we're probably still about five kilometers away from there, from the radar that is. And uh, yeah, obviously, clearly we can still hear that um, getting over here, and you know, I'm taking the body measurement. And so that signal is arriving in me. As you saw in the video before, you know, the signals from the navigation aids, you know, can still reach us within our homes, within our bedrooms. And it's just all adding to the, uh, you know, the overall exposure to high frequency radiation. Um, so, you know, here uh, behind me on that side, you've got the, uh, the VOR, which is a navigation aid. And then uh, above the tree line a little bit on the left there, where the radar is and we can hear that radar quite clearly that's a little sweep that comes by there was again and every now and then you hear the ident of the navigation aid the morse code that identifies it and there was a little ident as well so as we've demonstrated kilometers, miles from here, we're picking, still picking that up inside people's bedrooms. Alright, it was educational.